We are in the Betaflight Configurator. Click Connect and then head over to the Receiver tab. And with your transmitter on and your receiver getting power, take a look at your minimum throttle channel value, which if you've set up your endpoints correctly should be around 1000. Now the value we care about changing is under a stick low threshold here on the right, AKA MinCheck. So what MinCheck does is it checks to make sure that the throttle is below a certain value before arming the quad. So the default value is 1050, and if the throttle is above that value, say at 1111, then it's not going to let you arm the quad. Now, when the throttle channel is below min check, the motors are going to be at idle. So because the default value is 1050, and if your endpoints are set up, your minimum throttle value is 1000, that means that the bottom 5% of your throttle stick isn't doing anything at all because the motors are just gonna stay at idle for that entire 5% of the throttle stick's travel. So to fix this, we actually want to lower the min check value down to a value just above our minimum throttle channel value. So I could get really greedy with this and go with something like 1000 because my minimum throttle channel value is 999. However, you want to try to account for things like jitter or maybe your gimbal shift a little bit and then all of a sudden your quad's not going to arm because you got way too greedy with this setting so if you're pretty confident in your transmitter maybe something like 1005 1010 or if your transmitter isn't too great then maybe 1020 or something like that but anything lower than 1050 is going to give you some improvement in your throttle resolution and if you can get it down to around a thousand that's about a five percent improvement in your throttle resolution so you can just set it to whatever you are comfortable with. And if your quad doesn't arm, then you know you got too greedy with it. So you can click save to apply that. And you may also be tempted to change the stick high threshold, AKA max check. However, this does not have the same dead zone at the top 5% of the throttle that min check causes at the bottom 5-ish percent of the throttle. So don't bother touching that one. That actually doesn't make any difference. That's it for this one. Thanks for watching.